A Derbyshire company that has made the world's fastest sledge is hoping it could speed up the recruitment of new staff. The sledge is actually built from the same carbon fibre material that's used in Formula One cars and they, as we know, are pretty fast. Now EPM Technology is hoping that the publicity could help attract more workers as it prepares to move into a new factory. Michael Sullivan reports. Downhill all the way and into the record books in snowy Andorra. Guy Martin piloted this sledge, built back in Derbyshire, out of carbon fibre. He beat the record held by Germany, achieving a top speed of 83.49 miles an hour. Hey. Well done. Well done. Hey. Fantastic braking. This is where the sledge was built, EPM Technology in Draycott near Derby. A carbon fibre specialist with a string of Formula One customers. We had Guy Martin and the crew on site for three days nearly, and, and we took them through the whole process doing that. But we made it in carbon fibre. In essence, how we make the Formula One parts, it, it was a Formula One sledge. This is the sort of thing the company makes here, a steering wheel for a Formula One car. Other stuff they won't allow us to show. But what isn't a secret here is the fact the company is having trouble recruiting the right skilled workers as it prepares to move into a new factory. The company's expanding. It's got a £4.75 million loan from the Derby Enterprise Growth Fund. It's just 101 days away from moving into a new factory in the city. Next time we go to a graduate show, people will know about us, they'll know about EPM, and hopefully that, that, that drives the recruitment on. We still have 42 open vacancies today. EPM decided to make two sledges for Guy's world record attempt. Just as well, one of them didn't survive an early test run. New technology, but old-fashioned thrills and spills. Michael Sullivan, BBC East Midlands today. Not many thrills and spills in this country, though. Toboggan-wise, is No, it? that looked really painful as well. <laughs>